Hi guys, it's Gary here from Happy Degree Backpack Specialists. Just making a short video today to talk about one of our popular products, is the Camo Pipe Bag. We got a lot of questions and a lot of feedback asking for advice on the correct way to install them and to make sure they're airtight. So today we're going to create a short video and put this brand new bag on our set of stocks and it'll give you some uh, hints and tips for, for doing your own pipes. So when your pipe bag arrives, it arrives in a, a plastic bag here, and everything we need is actually self-contained within. So opening it up, we've went for the hybrid bag today, it's the, the thicker skin one, and it's the most popular product, uh, most popular bag that we certainly sell here. Once complete with everything you need, uh, you've got your O-ring Jubilee clip here, and also a water trap as well as standard. So let's take a look at the bag first. Also this one, uh, the customer's chosen an extended medium bag, uh, which means it's a medium size, but just got an extended uh, portion at the back. So, first things first, we've got to get the bag, bag opened up. When we're putting any stocks into a bag, we always go from inside, that way there is a seal on the inside of the, the bag, we want that to be coming out of the way. What we always do, take a small spot of washing up a bit, and it's literally just a, a pea sized amount. And all we're going to do is just lubricate the, the collar, just to allow it easier access for our stocks. So from the inside, we want to be able to get that come straight out. Now, the most important thing with the bag is to make sure that we put the, the stocks through far enough until it clips into the, the grooves of the stock. If you don't do that, it will become loose, and if it becomes loose, sadly, then it won't be airtight. So, we continue on just getting the rest of the stocks in this bag. It can be quite tough to get the, the particular ferrules through the, through the collars. Please don't be scared to, to force them through. This is the it is fantastic material for for a collar. Incredibly tough. So again, we're all the way through. That's like they've clipped into the groove. Just two more chatter. Yeah, so two more drone sorts to do. Just pop a wee, wee bit of feather back with you. Right, okay, so I'm gonna put that. Through. Uh, we've got more on our last turn run now. Almost there. Clipped in, which is fantastic. Okay, now the last one is the, the chanter stock. Uh, I say with the camo bags, the, one of the great things they do provide is they provide the Olin, uh, the Ol O ring and Jubilee clip. And one of the most common problems that we see is people trying to put the O ring on top of the bag. Now the O ring is designed to go actually straight onto the stock. So we just roll that on from the bottom, and this time it's going to fill the groove. So the idea being when the, the stock's in the bag, the old end, sorry, the Jubilee clip will, will clamp the bag to the, to the stock. Almost. Oh, fantastic wee tool here just to help get this clamped in. You might find with the, it's particularly with the hybrid bags that you have to open the Jubilee clip up slightly just to get it on first. Now the most important thing is to make sure this Jubilee clip is right on top of the o-ring. Feeling, feeling to make sure that you can have it covered. Once it is there, I'm going to tighten this on top. Perfect. And just one last check, mate. If you, can, if you feel the O ring, you've more than likely just slightly missed it. 
And that's the stocks included. And that's an all stock set installed. So now we we'll always have one last test when installing a new bag. And that's just to make sure it's airtight. So we're just going to pop cocks in these. It's absolutely solid and it's good to play. One of the good checks always you be hear the hissing if you've missed the uh, or sorry if you get a slight hissing and sound from the, the chatting stock in particular, it usually means that you've just missed the o ring with the Jubilee clip. One thing we never advise, never ever put it in water. Uh, a lot of people would dunk it in the bath for that to check. Uh, we always advise against that. But as you can see there, if you follow that simple principle, one of the most reliable bags in the market, the cam there. That's good to go for the new customer.